two one two mic check one two one two yep what's going on everybody welcome back to my channel scotty got games we're back with another one y'all with a new game <clears throat> this is called quantum break uh it's another uh remedy entertainment game no uh, the same company that was that made alan wake and alan wake 2 so um there's some characters in here that's um that's the actors and actresses in this in this game so I, I was very intrigued by this game so i want to know what what this game is about so i'm not gonna um not gonna waste no much time um before we get into this gameplay make sure you like the video make the like the video subscribe if you're new we gotta blow up this channel and let's get back in, let's get into it quantum break All right, the number one killer is time. That is the number one killer is time. It destroys us all. This is what you need to know. Time broke, a growing fracture leading to the end of time. We went after a device that could fix it. Things turned ugly. Paul Spring was there to stop us. Oh, yo. He has superpowers. Jack. And me both. We failed. Jack. And of course, time travel was involved. Jack. Going too fast for you? Okay. What do you want to cover first? You tell me. Let's start at the beginning. When you first arrived at Riverport University. I mean, he was giving the summary of it. I came back home to see my best friend, Paul Serene. He wanted to show me what he'd been working on. Okay. My brother Will was a scientist. He was also involved. Paul said it was world changing. He was right. Look at the graphics back then, the 2016, that shit was crazy. Riverport University. Here we are. Hey, thanks for the ride. No problem. Okay, we walking. You'd been away for six years. Paul and I had kept in touch, but well, not so much. How did it make you feel? I was just happy to see Paul. Okay, let me look let me look around. Good morning. Yeah. I guess I should go find Paul. Right, because it's not part of the story. Where'd that guy go? Oh, wait, what? Hold up. He was just right here. Hey, yo, what's going on? He was literally just standing right there and just said hello to me. I doubt he's out here. We better head into the campus. Oh, well, it's gonna be one of them games, huh? <laughs> Rough night, huh? It's just whatever's done not even matter anymore. I'm, yeah, he, I'm, yeah. My man has. What do we have? My man has. It's supposed to be a Jaeger, and like three cans of beers. 
No four cans of beers. Are you a protester? Come on now. Oh, somebody must have had a party. Oh, Jack, you just got to the campus. Where are you? God, it's good to hear your voice. Uh, when you hit the courtyard, look right. You'll see this fancy modern physics building with the lights on. I'll meet you inside there. I am so looking forward to this, man. You still haven't told me what this is. I know. See you soon. Why 4 a.m.? Why not wait till morning? 4 a.m.? Paul had always been a showman. Oh, that's why you that's why you out there like that. Hey you take action now. Monarch Solution wants to tear down the pride of uh Riverport University, the the beautiful historic library building generations has studied in. This is the part of the heretics, but but they don't care. Are you gonna put up with that? Or of course you aren't. Of course you not of course you're going to take action. Of course you're of course you are. First of all, go online, use Save the library and get loud. The only way to stop it. Look at okay. So the monarch. So the monarch is trying to tear down the public library. Vaguely ominous. Sure is. Hey, yo, look at this. Somebody is lit, boy, on the ground. Some protest. <laughs> you say he's a, he's a protester? I never seen protest protesters be lit like this. Ain't no way. Hey, do you know where the physics building is? You mean the big ass metallic turtle behind me? Hard to miss, man. Thanks. Oh, wow. Protests seem like a lost cause. Maybe sympathize with the students. I'm trying to get all the information I can. If you're with that fraternity, you've done enough damage. We're being shut down. <laughs> hey, I come in peace. I'm just meeting a friend nearby. At 4 a.m.? Yeah, tell me about it. Well, we're spreading awareness about Monarch Solutions, so if you want to know how badly they're giving us the shaft, then you can just ask me. All right, what's going on here? Okay. How would you feel if you knew a corporate monopoly was taking a massive dump all over your personal history? Uh, that's quite an opener. Good. Because that beautiful library over there is over a hundred years old. It's part of the city's heritage. And Monarch Solutions plans to tear it down tomorrow. Do you want to know why? We've got a chart with all the details. Let me see the chart. Go ahead, check out the chart. Let me see the Monarch Project. Monarch's so tearing down the library to build another research facility. And for what? I bet you're going to tell me. Hmm, to push their corporate agenda. I mean, look at those numbers. They're slowly taking over the city and everybody's completely blind to it. Oh, it doesn't look good. Hey, hey I'm gonna, gonna be my friend, but... Okay. Like right All right. Enjoy, enjoy your, your booty call. Not exactly. Not exactly. ...using earning from the shade and investment. 2000, we made a question in regard to who truly running the monarch. 2001, Bob. So, they've been planning this since 1999 uh 2001 brought out a major media outlet question stopped by asked question stopped being asked question stopped being asked so so it so it's something deeper than here so 2001 they stopped asking questions 
I wonder what happened around that around that time in 2001. So 2006 brought the Gill Islands tore down war mom momentum monuments to construct R&D faculties. They destroyed monuments. Hey, yo, that's crazy. What what about the people's memory off that island? That's crazy. Um, demolished um, Riverport Silver. Uh, central train station to build my towers so y'all destroy the train station to build the tower in the middle of the city purchased the tires industrial district and dry docks putting thousands of people out of work and you that's messed up aim to diminish the uh riverport university history to replace it with yet another fact that's yeah, what is that? What is their agenda? Before we, before we get in contact with Paul, I need to find some more narratives. Because if there's any more before we get to his friend Paul, I need to know now. This people is gone. Let's see, let's get in here. Expose the lies, find the truth. It's not a lake, it's an ocean. Oh shit. You know what this is. Bro, universe. this is Alan Wake. We're just a speck of light floating in an endless ocean of darkness. So this is like like the aftermath by five years Every later. Story finds its writer. That's the clicker. That's out of weight. Hey, yo, that's crazy. So it's like giving us like Easter eggs. So Al Casey was missing. Like that. All of us have two faces. The one we wear for all to see, and the face that lies beneath in the dark. I ain't gonna lie. I can't wait till I play Alan Wakes too. I cannot wait. Paul had always been hungry for success. Driven. He made it onto a lot of those top young professionals lists. And now he was coordinating some huge project at the university. It's a big deal for him. Hey, protest's over. At home. Not why I'm here, Chief. Bolster that safety whistle. Frick. Where's your uniform? Excuse me. Come on. I've been in shit enough to smell on security. You sure this is somewhere that you want to be sniffing around? Was that supposed to be a threat? Because that's adorable. Just walk away. Liam Burke. 
a monarch security officer. Our first meeting was cordial compared to him introducing a rifle butt to my head later on. Wait, what? You gonna put a rifle against your head? Move along. What is this? 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 Oh, these are the uh, doctor's memorial. Oh, shout out to him. Hmm. Not exactly modest, are we, Paul? Oh, that's his friend. He's the youngest part of him. So he's been around since this thing started in 1989 so what's what's he trying I don't know what's he trying to pull I like how they gave us like an open op kind of like an open world to understand what's going on not pretty much just like side missions but like give us give us a roundabout of the story of not a story like a narrative just, yeah a story of narrative you made a long trip just to see a research project of what's going on well reading between the lines paul was under a lot of pressure he needed a friend i wanted to help him anyway i could son of a bitch jack joyce in the flesh. The esteemed Mr. Paul Serene. I'm shaking money bags. Shut up and bring it in. Welcome home. Six years. Now we're starting to think you'd never come back. Yeah, me too. Come on. This way. We're going upstairs to the project lab. First class, thank you for that. It's a step up from our van trip to Utah. I missed that van. I'm guessing that Will's not meeting us. He doesn't know we're here. I knew Paul had asked my brother Will to consult on his project. Will was all the family I had, but he was difficult. Hold on, before, before we get... In here, Jack. Quite the facility you got here. What can I say? I have a knack of milking money out of wealthy investors. You don't say. Check over here. Protests against Monarch are going strong, I see. Well, it used to be our forte. You're the one that sold out. Oh, I don't know. It wasn't successful. Too bad. Oh, he used to be Try. a protester, huh? Okay, let me. All right, let's let's get in here then. There's more to this than you're letting on. Is it about my brother? I still worry about him, huh? If Will did something wrong. Then Jack, man, look, I've been tight-lipped about this for a reason. This project we've been working on is going to change the entire world. Uh, why do I smell one of your long-winded presentations on the horizon? Yep. I would never. Oh, look. <laughs> a perfectly placed presentation to illustrate the project. Now, who put that there? <laughs> oh, shocking. Okay. Hold on. We'll get to your lab. I want to see your presentation. I know you love this stuff. Come on, man. Dazzle me. 
Well, if you insist. Progress. Our primary drive is a species. Over time, we have cured life-threatening illnesses. Explore the world. Oh, good. Going into marketing spiel mode. Don't ruin my flow. But there is one element which denies us true progress. Time itself. Now, I'm not a scientist, but here's how it's being explained to me. We've known that, in theory, a rotating black hole creates a deformation in space-time, potentially allowing travel through both space and time. What? Years ago, William Joyce, your brother, posited the existence of chronon particles, now known as Meyer-Joyce particles, which fill an all-encompassing field, enabling the constant and steady progression of time. Here at Project Promenade, we have combined both these theories to discover a way to manipulate that field. And the results are staggering. There's more, but that's enough of a primer for now. All right, let's do this. So this is about quantum physics. Paul, you know my brother spent years stuck down that rabbit hole. Is that why you brought Will on as a consultant? When Dr. Kim passed away, your brother was an obvious choice to bring in to replace him. Okay. So Professor Williams was was the start root start of this. And if he passed away, then William was the replacement. Alright, we got that. Messing with the quantum physics of time and gravity. Welcome to Project Promenade. Project Promenade, okay. Five minutes before the fracture in time. Which means that in time. Oh shit. Maybe it's been corrupted. You guys must have some budget. What is all this? The future, Jack. You are looking at the biggest discovery of our time. It's impressive, but Will's the scientist. What do you need me for? There's a reason we're doing this at 4 a.m., Jack. I need someone I can trust. I need you to help me convince Will. Yeah, I had a hunch. Yeah. When your brother found out the scope of what we were building here, he... <sighs> you know Will. Yeah. Hang on, I gotta get something from my desk. Will overreacted. Scared off the investors, ranting about miscalculations, dangers, all with no evidence. It works, but they're going to cut our funding if I don't prove it. I see the concept of personal space is still foreign to you. Hey, somebody's got to keep tabs on you. Side of the big picture concerning the problem. Oh no, 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 can't trust what it, um, wait for the board to find a suitable replacement because there's are none. Kim will prove these figures a long time before his death. I refuse to let Will sabotage everything we're building here. And you usually get that estimate. Investors distracted by the time before the final decision. Um, investors have made the decision based on William's concern. They are halting all funds. For uh, okay, so we can sign that the project reform to further inspection. I do. Every, I did everything I could to sway the votes, but the only only board member who vote in your favor is Martin Hatch. Brought up William Joyce's question on mental health, but the damage was already done. He planted the seed of doubt. Let me know how you. Okay. Okay, this is 
this is getting somewhere so they needed the funds to get project um Pardonum going but william had his doubts so you know when you have doubts there's that's something going on this project the funders start looking at like i don't know about losing money about that so we're gonna pull back before we even um before we even get to it so he's using jake to convince will that this project is going to go that's going to go work and we can go forward with these fundings that's why that's why they got this big ass building oh jesus christ Paul, what are you doing? Jack, you know asking for her help is not easy for me. I am in deep trouble. You see, the tests I have to run here are not strictly speaking legal. You're the only one I can trust to help me with this. Whatever Will did, I want to make it right. I love my older brother, but he didn't make it easy. It's already essentially set up. Of course, he was skeptical about this project because he don't know what's going to happen. Jack, thank you. I knew I could count on you. Like, it's crazy. Like, this, this motherfucker Paul put, convinced his younger brother, to, gave his younger brother to convince his older brother to get this project to go. That's crazy to, like, to involve family into this. Of the own selfishness. Okay. Um I pack my things, hit to his he said well this about just make sure Will doesn't know that I'm coming home. Okay. Will doesn't know that he's here. Wow. That kind of the baggage I need to unpack. I just booked a flight from Bangkok to you were in Bangkok? Shit, I would have stayed. Anyway, I just booked my phone. You a flight from Bangkok to Riverport First Class Taxi. I'll be waiting for you at the airport when you get here and drive you straight to the university. I can tell, can't tell you anymore over the email, but we'll explain everything when you get here, which you explaining to me right now. Just say you just saved my life. There aren't the ideal conditions for our reunion, but we can't wait. Almost over two decades as a friends. Not, um, not once have you ever asked for help. This must be bad. You okay? What kind of trouble? Of course I'm in. I'm here for you, man. I'm currently in Bangkok, but I can't find my way to Norpa as soon as possible. We'll wait. We'll wait by the computer for for the details. Uh. To Jake. Jack, Jack, you know I'm the last person I ever asked you for a favor. No, just I need your help. Everything I have built over my career is all at risk of crashing down. If I don't do something, I need to take the only measure that will put this project back on track. Like I said, um, but I can't do it. But I can't do it alone. I need somebody I can trust to help fix it. Where are you right now? I have you know, 42 hours. I know number one. Do your best. Borderline creepy. Keep the folds on my phone in the background. You will know, never change. Put your hands. Embed the timeline in the future. I mean, it's been too long. You come home to visit the ocean, so it must be. America is still working it out. Pretty much is just catching up until he asked of a favor. Which I said. So what's this? Commodore schematics. Travel clockwise leads to a forward progression in time. Counterclockwise travel backwards. Oh, it's like you invented a clock. I need you to push the lever over there, labeled Chronon Conduit. That'll activate the core. I'm gonna run diagnostics and make sure it's 
sure it remains stable. Testing a black out. hole, bro. Just illegal, moderately reckless. I'd raised some hell with Paul in the past. I could tell this was different. Still, I didn't understand how massive and far reaching the consequences for this would be. How could I? I knew Paul. He played it cool, but I could tell he was nervous. It's happening. We're really doing this, Jack. It's going to be amazing. Like, like his brother, he was he was skeptical about this experiment. Here, take this. You need this key to activate the corridor. We need to turn the keys at the same time to activate. Security precautions. Ready? It's like we're launching a nuke. Right. Wait, we're not launching a nuke, right? One way to find out. Three, hey, yo. two, one. Jack. What? You didn't say zero. Come on, man. We need ground rules. For okay. This. You turn. I'll follow. Close enough. Witness. This is crazy, Paul. I mean, this can't be safe. What happens when our team has already proved it works in the trial phase? It is ready. We passed every test, every inspection. We're about to make history, Jack. All you have to do is hit that switch. I don't know about this, man. Two minutes to the past. Remember this moment. Paul, <laughs> what? How? It... <laughs> hey, yo. It's fine. It's okay. Stay calm, Jack. Stay calm. There's. There's, two, There's of you. two of you. You just fucking multiply. This is exactly what was supposed to happen. That's he's he's me, a future version of me from two minutes in the future. <laughs> Your evil future self. Evil future self. We did it. Fucking incredible. I mean, just imagine the implications. We could warn people about disasters before they disasters happen. Before they happen. Cure, cure diseases, diseases before, before they, they spread. spread. I just had this conversation. Still sounds good second time. Jesus Christ. Now go into the machine. You need to complete the cycle. Yeah. Yes. Of course. Wait, Paul. What are you doing? It's all a big loop, Jack. I need to enter the machine and travel back to the moment I exited the machine in order to, well, be here. And what if you don't? There is no what if. I'm here, it's already happened. 
You saw it, Jack. We did it. Well, that's impossible. That's that's literally impossible. I mean, I can't even. There's I no time fathom. to stop now. We need to test the other direction. Set the machine to five minutes to the future. Five minutes into the future? Jesus Christ. I don't know. What are you doing? You have to help me with this. We have to shut this thing down now. No, 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 stop it! Shut up! Hold, hold on. The core. Hold on. We can't shut it down. Paul's still in there. Well, shut up! Look shut at me. up! Look at me! Put the gun down and we can talk, okay? No, there's no time. I'm thinking straight. Put the gun down. Jesus Christ, Will. Time is going to end. Jack, you have to trust me. Or what? You okay? I think so. I'll find a way out. Make sure Will's okay. Yeah. Okay. Bro, look. Look, bro, look at the damn room. I could hear Will's words in my head. Everything is... Time is going to end. Everything is... Everything is slow-mo. Look at this shit. What the fuck is this? It should have worked, Jack. What the hell is working? Fracture in time. You were there when the time broke. This is crazy. Ah, okay. I see. This is permanent? Well, you broke time. Well. Jack. Hey, Will. This is your statement. What have you done? She warned me. I knew she was right. All this time. Check. 
You just... What, just... Go. This way. Move. That was the first time my power started to manifest. An out-of-control burst of energy that saved Will. Jack, your proximity to the Pulse, it... It must have altered your relation to the Chrono. Will. What I just did back there. What the hell is happening? That's what I'm telling you. Not in the right language. Explosion make time go bad. If time is an egg, then that egg is fucking broken. Time egg is fucked. What? Why is there an egg in this? There's a fracture in time. It's breaking down. Leading to the end of time and door. What? I'm locked. They cut my security clearance. <laughs> ah! That didn't help. Stay back. I'll get it open. HQ, securing the well, server room. Over. More of them. Hide. <laughs> Warn Paul about this. About the calculations. I tried to make him listen to me. I shoved in a gun in my face? Yes, a gun. The universal symbol for shut the fuck up and listen to me. Sound logic is all you. No, what? I don't know. Hold up. We are on this side. Okay. We sure he didn't head back up to the lab? He could have gone back and tried to take the service out of the lab. This doesn't make any sense. on his way there. What are, are you even here? Your biggest water. concern right now? Backups on route to flush him out. Paul brought me here to clean up your mess. My mess? Do you even... Come on, then. I can't see shit back there. I may have to crawl behind. Fuck. <laughs> hey, yo, this is like a movie. <laughs> No context for any of this, Jack. We weren't here. A lot happens in six years. It does. This is bigger than us. Can't make it personal. They're trying to kill us, Will. It's pretty goddamn personal. Listen, getting you involved is the last thing I wanted. I, I'm sorry. Right. Fracturing time is only going to get worse. We have to stop this before it's too late. How? First, we have to get to my car. You're better at the door thing. Will, get out! Oh god! It's armed! Opening fire! Pin down! Hey, yo. That's the same motions that Adam was on um, Alan Wake. Will, are you okay? I think so. Jack, that was... I know. This is way out of hand. I'd used a gun before. I'd been in a couple tough spots. Never had an army of pro-gunmen chase me. Always positive that the experiment would work. That the figures were correct. Because specialists were a bunch of goddamn idiots. Their formulas were missing these variables entirely. You're seriously making corrections right now? Well, if they made them in the first place, we wouldn't be here. Let's get out of here. I'm just in here to talk to you to watch the next episode to see how Tanzu does up the action. Not good. This is not good. There's the elevator by the lobby. Thank <laughs> you.
Not again. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You can do this. You can do this. Where is everybody? I don't like it. You heard the... Hey, 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 hey. Acting up again. No surprise. We have. Uh, Jack and William Joyce been detained. Did you hear that? They know our names. They knew we'd be here. They must be after the machine. The elevator. It's the only way out. The bullets are infinity, but the but the machine gun is what? 108 bullets. What type of shit is that? Hold on. Somehow I missed out on five extra narrative narrative Come on. books. Alright, we going up. We can't go to your car. Monarch could be expecting that. We have to, Jack. It's important. To fix the fracture. I I need we need to get to my car. Okay, just just walk me through this, Will. Okay, time's broken. Fine. But now you're saying we could fix it? In theory. I built something for such an event years ago. But finding the countermeasure won't be easy. A countermeasure? What? Okay. What happened? Maybe the door's still open. Let me try. Somehow I can focus and unfreeze Will. Even if the world is still frozen. Oh, wow. Sir. She was right. About the fracture. About all of this. Where's your car? This way. It's... Okay. Okay, Will. Calm down, okay? 
I'll take care of this. I'll, I'll fight my way through. I'll get the car and I'll bring it around. Are you sure you can handle this? No. Are you sure you can fix time? No. Then we'll call it even. Right. That is definitely even. Here. Go meet the keys. Hey, Jack. Be careful. Yeah. Okay, I, I will. What the hell? My powers were growing. I started to sense things, premonitions, echoes from the past. They want us to find a car belonging to. Joyce, well, you gotta play it's coming. Somebody's here! See an echo of the past. Will arriving at the university. Oh snap! So you can catch. That's crazy, bro. Cause you can catch your brother in the past. I hope they got him. Not too late. That's. Oh wow, that is, you can see the past too? Oh shit! Something clicked. I could reach out and stop time in a focused oh, area. You don't know what you're doing. What the hell? Fuck, they're coming from where I left Will. I gotta get back. Oh, that's hard. That is that is hard. That is hard. Oh, damn. I gotta get back to him. I can hear the Library. We might still be able to cash them. 
Why are you helping me? You're with them. It's more complicated than... Look, I don't know if you can make it, but you should hurry. That's the first time you saw Beth Wilder. Yeah, but definitely not the first time she saw me. Will. Will! Shut the hell up. Hello. But just shut, shut the fuck up, up alright? Right? Boss said to take him to the library. He wants to deal with this one first. Okay. So well, your visions can can lead you where you need to go. That's man. Oh damn. Come on. That's that is tough. That is tough, boy. I did not know. You gotta keep moving, Jack. Don't make Don't sense. Make sense. Dragging this asshole to the library? library? Airlift's already initiated. He should be gone by now. The time machine. You taking the time machine? Hey, hey. I said no talk. talk. This vision got range, boy. You still had no idea that Wilder was helping you? She wasn't the only one.
the library. Why are you taking me here? It's a library. I need to return some fucking books. HQ, we've got William Joyce in the library. Over. Will. They did it to the library. I gotta find a way in. I gotta get to him fast. Like this game is tough. Where was I at 2016? Where was I at all when it comes to these remedy games? There's gotta be another way in. There's gotta be another way in. On the other side, okay. Where did that come from? Vision, times, time dodge. We'll do time this stop. Is Prime. We've got the time machine core in transit. Wait, that's where I can see it. Whoa, 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 what was that? What the hell is going on around here? <clears throat> we need to figure that out, Jack. I'm trying to figure out who's sniper that man. HQ, we've got William Joyce in the library. Awaiting orders. We got over. I wonder what the other is. Oh shit, there's ammo right there. Is ready to blow. Now? Ooh, headshot. Slap a pistol with my brother. Crazy. A time shield. This man can create a time shield. This man is unbelievable.
got a whole new batch of messed up shit I need you to explain. Get me out of here first. Is there like explosives on here? We have to hurry. Where's my car? I didn't like the color. Let's get a new one. What? No, Jack. I need them. <clears throat> Hold that thought. My briefcase was in that car. I'll take you shopping. It's a fucking briefcase. A briefcase that contains something I need in order to stop the fracture. And you didn't think you'd sell that out to me before. Last chill. I was a little busy getting kidnapped. Yeah, well, nothing like me. Shit, I need to explain. You got any theories about being able to manipulate time? No. Time's the lucky point. Get you! Who's shooting? They want to take us alive. I think they changed their minds. Is that all of them? Yeah, I think so. We have to get to my briefcase. Then we find Beth Wilder. Why? Who is she? She knows about the fracture. I trust her. Glad you trusted somebody. What are we doing, following? It's not that simple, Jack. I kept secrets from you to keep you safe. Safe? Look around you, Will. Does this feel safe to you? This isn't my fault. Beth warned me this would happen. I did everything in my power to stop it. But you never told me any of this. I couldn't just... How long have you known? We don't have time for this now, Jack. We have to get to that briefcase. Come on, nigga. Let's move before more of them show up. If you can move your ass, we, we, we can escape. Jack! What the hell? Paul? Paul? Jack, we gotta go. Hold on. Oh, snap! Paul, what happened to you? What are you doing? Only what's necessary. Think about this. You don't know what's at stake. I know exactly what's at stake. That's why I'm here. You believe you can stop what's coming? I'm giving you one chance to change your mind. This path, it's already said it can't be changed. The past, the future, uh, uh, I've seen it. I've lived it. For 17 years. 17 years? 17 years. It was you, the first experiment. Come with me and we can see this through. Or hold on to your hope and burn with it. Now listen, I built a device. I can stop this. I can. You can't. This is madness. There's no harm in trying. There is. That's why I can't risk you opposing me, Will. It doesn't have to end like this. We can't just let this happen. I'll never stop trying. It took me years to come to terms with what must be done. But we don't have no, years. Do wait, it. wait, wait. <sighs> Paul, don't even do it. Trigger. I never wanted this. <gasps> That's him. In the act one. Okay.
My name is Paul Serene. I founded Monarch Solutions 17 years ago with a very clear purpose. There are those who would question my actions. I'm recording this as a final statement of vindication, a testimony of how things came to be. I've always been devoted to my mission. Never deterred from my goal, no matter the sacrifice. Because I've seen where this leads. I've seen where it all ends. We have a problem. No word from Jack Joyce's transport. It should have arrived here by now. We may have a traitor on the inside. You're due for your treatment. I'll find who's behind this. Find Jack. That's our priority. Get your best man on it. There's more. As you know, Jack's level of interference led to unexpected complications. Witnesses from the university were transported here. You need to take a look. We can't afford any further obstacles at this stage of the plan. Now, I see two options. We could use force to remove any loose ends. But if those witnesses disappear, the public will start asking questions. Potentially turn on Monarch. <clears throat> All clear, sir. We have to run a broad PR strategy get the city on our side. But that leaves us with the... The loose ends. Precisely. The choice is yours, but keep in mind. The men will view your decision as a unified strategy moving forward. <laughs> I want this delivered to my office. What is it? A reminder. the hell that was. I suggest we deal with the issue hand. Liam Burke over there can explain the situation in more detail. Of course. How long until the core is ready for transport? It'll be around tomorrow. Our headquarters in less than an hour. Installation should be complete before the gala. Good. Jack would never understand the necessity of what I'd done. It wasn't the death William deserved. But his knowledge posed too great a risk to our plan. Okay. Mm, classification project consultant for project. Oh no. Oh no. Paul. The men are waiting for your input. Hold on, nigga! Witness the court of his uh, operation on catch it alive and possible deliver to Paul. Um. And stab his brother. Serene brought Jack down the whole building Moon. just to take out that gig. You know, the physics. Stone cold, man. And Paul's assistant. So Talk about making a point. Age 19. Shh, he's listening. The first time machine prototype delivered the counter measures during the project for the known consultant of the death of, after the death of Dr. Kim. Okay, so they came back in time trying to stop everything. Um, undiagnosed by likely suffering from the what's this this one disorder highly intelligent received warning of fracture from the unknown a female source may have received knowledge of home relations of monarch options operations or refused to accept inevitability of end of time May lead to unpredictable behaviors benefiting Dr. Joyce for her sent in the time machine lab during the onset of the fracture. 4:15 a.m. All actions are being covered by other teams. Rare 
Raider teams where we will wait until 4.16 to break the time. Breach the time machine. William Bruce. Okay, everything was everything was timing on this one. It was the first time I'd visited the Ground Zero operation in ages. The location I'd arrived in when I went 17 years back in time. The location where my fate was sealed six years ago. We had Jack in custody, but I was starting to witness visions from the future which made it clear that could change very soon. Parents deceased. Raised himself in teen, as teen years as his brother became distant. Distinct. Criminal records in Massachusetts. Grand Fado simply assaulted, attempted to rob and steal. Left Riverport in 2010. Never returned into the incident. Um, received weapon training in Legos Light and Army Heavy Firearms. Arrested for weapon related charges in 2015. Charges dropped. Ripley history, qualified history is of violent behavior when pushed, lack of respect of authority figures, no one the knowledge of the fic of fracture or monarch operation on site fracture will render Jack's I'm saying Cronin and Jay made possible low will overcome low abilities. Benefiting Jack and will be event I mean present in the time also was covered. Same thing. Sir, who is this? Amy Ferrero. She's one of the witnesses. Awaiting your orders on how to proceed. My powers grew stronger even as the Cronon Syndrome worsened. I could choose a path that would become the actual future. Oh, shit. But it wasn't optional. The moment wouldn't end until I made up my mind. Okay, the junction power reveals two predictable futures. Your decision and each prediction on oh, junction point will stir the story of the both games in live action. Okay, this is where the decision is. Initialize a PR campaign. I want to stay. And that violence was because of Jack Joyce. Monarch would take a PR friendly approach and manipulate the public into siding with us. Our lies would give us control. The manhunt continues as authorities search for Jack Joyce. Hey, anybody sneak around down there? Hey! I think that's Jack Joyce! We'd use the media to expose, then hunt for Jack. I uploaded all the files I stole on that USB stick from the Monarch security station. But the eyewitnesses would be out there, and Jack would learn our secrets. Hmm. Any potential threats to our plan need to be erased. Wait! Monarch would take a hardline approach. Crush all obstacles, eliminate all witnesses. It would be harsh. But I had made hard choices for the greater good before. I dug through the area and I found everything I could on him, bro. This is messed up, man. I trusted Monarch. But the people of Riverport would turn against us. Our secrets would be safe, but the public would hate us, and Jack would gain new allies. Monarch's got no authority to stop you, and you tell that to everybody on that bridge. Damn. Damn, what should I choose, y'all? If I choose the right, we'll get we'll gain we'll gain allies, but Jack will learn the truth. We go to the left. We'll get turned against. And Jack will know nothing. Hmm. 
Fuck it, I'm gonna go evil with it. We're taking the hard line. Any potential threats to our plan need to be erased. They're current the others to the ground zero operation. Make it quick. Painless. to guide us to decide how to best prepare for the inevitable end of time that gives the chosen few a chance to survive I've seen the end of time thirty five percent Jesus Christ Yeah, that's gonna be in all right, that's gonna be into act one the quantum break, but uh oh man, man, man. So much stuff was happening in act one. Um I like how this game is going right now, you know what I'm saying? Uh, discovering I mean pretty much I said throughout the whole gameplay that um and the um, emails I've been discovering that William was very skeptical about turning on his time machine and the quantum, how time would end if you turn on this quantum physics, which it ended up happening. Throughout that process, um, Jack got Jack got powers, which is pretty, which is pretty tough. He can. Um, he can see visions of the future and the past. He could do um, time stop. He could do time dodge. He could do time shield. Um, pretty much, I think. Yeah, he he lost his brother, which of course was it was it was going to happen sooner or later. But um, yeah, Paul was. Paul was some Paul was some different. Paul was sneaky about it. Very, very skeptical about it. I mean not skeptical about it. Very uh what's the word? Um can't even figure out the word of it. It's just the top of my tongue. Um very suspicious. And we end up um causing that and we end up um breaking time. So we into Act One. I think we going into. It's still Act One, but we gonna play as um, Paul. So, and also it was a it was a east it was a it was a little egg in there um, of Alan Wake of the return. So he it's been five years later since Alan Wake has been missing. So the FBI has been looking for him. One FBI was killed because of him. Yeah, man, it, it was dope. Shout out to um, Remini, Remini Entertainments. Cause I, well, cause apparently that that timeline, that Alloway timeline, is is all is all in that universe. It's a it's a universe timeline. So. We gonna get in more into that. Um, if you went through this gameplay with me, make sure you uh, like the video, comment down below what you think about this act, and subscribe if you're new, man. You get and hit that notification bell. You wanna be the first to um, watch the video. And until then, man. See your next gameplay. Peace.